Spotlight TV and I am Christian Lestat Bucera. For the people at home, who are we here with today? And Neil, a hitchhiker from the Texas Chainsaw Massacre. You, you like head cheese? We make it good. We're in Erie, Pennsylvania at the Erie Fest. <laughs> so you're having a good time at the Erie Horror Fest? We are having a ball. This is the most beautiful theater, man. It's a Warner Brothers theater that they completely restored. And we were looking down in the, uh, the theater. How many people does this seat? They go, around 3,000. I mean, it's huge. Thank gosh they haven't torn it down and you know made like condos and a parking lot out of it. It's beautiful. Hey, man, you can land an airplane in that foyer downstairs. So how's the reunion deal going? Oh, this is so much fun because usually we're like all over the country, you know, like, uh, hey, uh, uh, Gunners from Maine, up from Texas, Bill Bales and, and Terry from L.A., but to get us all together in one place is just great. Do you do a lot of conventions? We don't do as many as we used to because we, uh, we dub so much uh, Japanese anime. Uh, I'm always in the studio doing stuff. Uh, we just did, uh, I did 25 voices in uh, Gatchaman. Yeah. I got, uh, I was uh, Dr. Robotnik in Sonic the Hedgehog, Moyo Ken. Uh, we got four voices coming out next year on the new uh, Lord of the Rings game. That was a lot of fun. I fulfilled a lifelong dream. I get to be a hobbit. <laughs> So how do you people find out information about you and your projects? Uh, you can go to IMDB, okay, cool. Internet Movie Database, or you can go to MySpace. We usually have everything covered on MySpace. Just look up Edwin Neal uh, in the na name search and it should come up. Now the house they did that in, is that still a standing? The house is still standing. What they did was these guys came in and they bought the whole house, they like, cut it in half and put it on big trucks and took it over to Kingsland, Texas, where there's this beautiful lake. And they made a restaurant out of it. Now now it's like a bed and breakfast restaurant kind of place. So it's immortalized forever. And the guys that did it at the time didn't even know. Like, we didn't know. Is it a like, theme? Texas Chainsaw Massacre theme restaurant? No, uh -uh, not at all. It's <laughs> like a really nice restaurant. But you, but you can go there and, and, and have a real nice dinner and people walk around and you know, go, ooh, wow, I'm in the Chainsaw House. Have you ate there? Oh, many times. Yeah, yeah. yeah. We take groups down there. And, uh, they have a place, uh, the Alamo Draft House, which brings in a 50, 50 foot screen. They put it outside and they serve like barbecue. And then you can go and eat inside the restaurant too. And, we have Q&As and things like that. That's a lot of fun. So you have anyone you want to thank? Any shout outs you want to give out? I'd like to thank my parents for making my appearance tonight here possible. <laughs> I'd like to just thank all my fans for coming out and all the fans we've met and all the fans we're going to meet. Because man, it's a lot more fun with y'all than our lives. You want to sign this one off? Goodbye! It's good to meet you and come over to my house for dinner. This is Christian Lestat, motherfuckers.